Welcome back. Today we're going to finish our paper mache endangered gorilla mask. Art with Miss A. Let's begin. So now that your paper mache gorilla mask is dry, you're going to paint it. And I just used uh, an acrylic paint, a black paint, and I covered the entire mask, getting into all the creases. And I also used white and I mixed that with a little black and used a sort of a gray tint to highlight the nose and the mouth and I used pure white to do the uh, whites of the eyes and I used black to make the pupil and I also highlighted the um, upper eyebrow once that was done I decided I wanted to add another detail so I found some Old tissue paper that I had and I cut it into fringe by making little slits and basically glued little strips of fringe around the face looking at my reference picture um, to see how I was going to do this and I simply put a bead of glue and then would then put the strip of tissue paper and I would piece it together and see how it looked and if I needed to add a little more glue I would to reattach little areas but I think it turned out really nice just a little bit more and I drew on the mouth and there she is my beautiful gorilla Gorillas are considered endangered due to their small population and likelihood of becoming extinct. The females of the family usually have one baby every four years, which means that gorilla populations increase very slowly. Gorillas are herbivores and consume only the plants that they can find in their habitat. You ask, what can you do? Well, you can become more informed. And one wonderful woman who's doing excellent work is Ellen DeGeneres. She has her own website at www.theellenfund.org. And remember, if you can imagine it, you can make it, and you can change your world. Goodbye for now. See you next time.